So, race 11, or oh, race 10, should I say, sorry, trying to finish it any quicker, is a Melling Chase. It's a two and a half mile grade one event. Access Prosector for Hems, floats like a summer fly for Josh, front by middle for Tam, matching Goidy for Leon Van Rensburg, Morton and Overseer for Daily Lad, Sarah Gosa Manuscript for Leon, Troy for Paul Rhodes, Bobby XL for Ponty Paul, in the nick of time for Joshua Southern, Napa Rigi for Paul Frisk, Petra Mina Della for James Shea, Shea Reflection for Ryan Costello, Starbet Mona for Davey, Stoke of Luck for Paul Rhodes and Zoma Radad Alarab for Hems. Plenty of tongue twisting names in this out of the 15. We go to two and a half miles to challenge for the Melling Chase. The start has got him away. We'll wait for him to settle down as they approach the first fence. With the 14 they have to negotiate. And it's going to be Tam King's front by the middle that looks like it's going to lead us over it with a Stroke of Luck. These two race to the first. Eventually. <laughs> there it is. And they're both over it. As is a remainder field. Nice big high jump at the rear by Shady Reflection. But it's front by the middle from Stroke of Luck. Floats like a summer fly and Access Prospector. There you are. One, two, three, four. As they go over the second, they'll take it well. Access Prospector was a little bit slow over it. Shuffles back a little bit and allows a matching goidy to move on to fourth as Omra down Alarab's fifth. They go to the third, a really poor jump there by Stroke of Luck as he went straight through the top of it. We'll shuffle over towards the rail now. Another one out really wide here is Troy. And wider still is I think that's Naparigi. They want to get better position. But we're still being led by front by middle. And we have lost one there. Petrovina Della's gone. She was a fool and we missed it. Apologies there to I think James Shea. But it's front by middle from floats like a summer fly, stroke of luck and matching goidy. Then we've got access prospector in the nick of times. So I'm out Alarab, Troy out wide, and the Robertson horses of Starbeck, Mona and Moreland overseer. And inside of that is Bobby XL. And then we'll get over the fifth, but a little bit slow. And we've got Naprigi over towards the rail again. So I go some manuscript. Shady reflection. It's a shade out of the camera shot. So with a mile and a half still to travel as they go over the six, the leaders are over it. As is everybody else, a really poor jump there by, I think that was Troy. It's shuffled right out of the picture now. So front by the middle, joined by Stroke of Luck, floats like a summer fly, there you one, two, three. Then followed through by Access Prospector in the nick of time. We've got a wall of horses, the first of the Robertson horses, Starbet Mona up against the fence. They go over the seventh, so they're halfway through the fences now. And it's front by middle, Stroke of Luck. Thanks back to floats like a summer fly, followed through by a nick of time, matching Goidy out a little bit four or five wide. Access Prospector on his insides, on Radab Alrab, closer to the fence, and Starbet Mona. Morland Overseer looking for room towards the rear, got nowhere to go, and the wide outside of all those is Bobby XL. And then just being followed through by Troy, Naparigi, and Shady Reflection, we can't see. But up front, he's front by middle and stroke of luck together. And roughly a mile left to go get to this next one, which is past the beer tent, we get to see first, I think. And there's the beer tent, a few people outside, and here comes the fence, and it's front by middle, and a stroke of luck, and lead us over it, slow jump by front by middle, but he's still there. Everyone else is over it and all still on their feet here. So with seven furlongs to go, it's Stroke of Luck now. Leads by length from front by the middle. Queuing up behind them, a matching goidy floats like a summer fly. A couple of them didn't get over it well. Zombra down Alarab, Bobby XL on the outside. Asper Prospector in the nick of time has got himself blocked in as they go over the tenth. The leader went straight through it. So front by the middle is taken over now by Stroke of Luck and matching goidy pushing through Zombra down Alarab. Out wide is Aspect Prospector, Bobby XL. The the Sutherland horses are floats like a summer fly in the nick of time. But up front as they go to the 11th, that's four from home. It's front by the middle, matching Goidy. Stroke of luck and Zomerid out Alarab. They're a length and a half away from the rest. But out of the pack comes Starbet Mona on the wide outside. So we're inside the final half mile now. It's front by middle, matching Goidy. Zomerid out Alarab. Stroke of luck. They're having to go wide now to take these. As the one that comes out is Saragossa Manuscripts. They all go to the 12th. The better jump was front by the middle. And he's got a length advantage. But here comes Zomerid out Alarab, matching Goidy. 
access prospect to between the horse Starbet, Mona and Moreland Overseer. Zaragoza manuscript, the Southern horses are not in there, so down to the final quarter mile. They go over the penultimate, and it's Zomorada and Arab from Machin Goidi. Running on now is Moreland Overseer on the outside, Starbet, Mona, but they're going to catch this winner. Zomorada and Arab, will he be the winner with a furlong left to run? It's Zomorada and Arab from Machin Goidi, Moreland Overseer. It's Zomorada and Arab over the last, but Machin Goidi just jumps a little bit better inside the final half, and here's Zomorada and Arab. Here comes Matching Goyne at the line, matching goal. Somradad Arab finally stops Leon Van Rensburg from winning a great one event. Well done to Craig Allen there with Somradad Arab. Although the matching Goyne did his best just by half a length. Starbuck Manor running well for third. Fourth was Morn and Overseer also for David Robertson. And front by the middle, a long time leader for Tan King came in fifth. So a good win there for Craig Allen. Well done. With just a couple of races left to go today. Uh, I'll hand you over to Martin.